your girl, North here, and today we're going to be doing some Animal Jam quizzes because I don't know what else to do. So let's get into it. Okay, so I am on some random website called, ugh, there's a stupid video and I don't know what it is, I'm really, okay. I am on a website called allthetest.com and it's pretty weird. So we're just gonna do this quiz. What type of trader are you? Wondering what type of trader you are? This is the perfect quiz. Find out if you are a leader, warrior, apprentice, baby, or a lost trader now. Oh, so it's like how skilled you are with trading. I don't know anything about the haters and stuff. Where do you usually trade? Select one. Uh, I mean, Anywhere in Alden is probably... What do you usually trade? In-store items, your rarest items, rare item Mondays, den betas, or clothing betas. I mean, I usually trade like clothing betas and stuff. They're a really good thing to trade to like work up to den betas and to the other stuff. Which item is the rarest? No cheating. Okay, the options are light pig headdress, beta couch, magenta cloak, necklace, and beta creature mask. A uh, beta creature mask, rarest item in Animal Jam. Hands down, everybody knows that. I have no idea what a beta couch is. Actually. The magenta cloak is technically one of a kind, so that's actually the rarest item. You have a rare item Monday head- Oh, stop opening this random advertisement, I don't like it! You have a rare item Monday headdress for trade and want to trade it down. Which best offer do you accept? Oh, I don't know, rarity trading, okay. One fake magenta furry. <laughs> that's literally store bought, what the heck. One yellow party hat, one black long, two red long, two black long wrist. 20 real den betas, one white beta tail. Uh, I'd say this. This is probably the most accurate offer. Do you usually trade down or look for a higher worth to trade for? For example, do you trade four black logs for one bigger item or do you trade those four black logs down for multiple smaller worth items? Need more items, so I will trade down. Gotta look for my dream item. What is my list even worth? If I like it, then I'll accept trading everything I have for a rare. I'd say gotta look for my dream item. I mean, I haven't traded in a while, but like, that's usually what I did when I traded. Do you focus on your likings or the worth only? Mix of both, usually likings, usually worth, worth only, likings only, okay. I'd say mix of both, cause like, why would you want to trade for an item that's really rare if it looks hideous, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's why specs are so popular, is because they look good on animals, but also, with actual trading, you gotta focus on rares. And sometimes items that would otherwise look absolutely hideous look good just because they're rare. Like the beta creature mask, everybody wants it, and it's kinda ugly, but like if people see you wearing it, they think, wow, that's a really good look. Even if the look absolutely sucks, the point is you have a beta creature mask, so therefore it's good. So I'd say usually worth, but like... Stop giving me advertisements! Do you collect specific items? Sometimes no, yes. Yeah, totally. Someone offered you your dream item, but they asked for an overtrade. Do you accept? Yes. Honestly, I have like mixed feelings about overtrading. On the one hand, I get it. You're kind of like getting the short end of the deal, but at the same time, who cares? If you get the item you want, who cares if you're overtrading a little? That's how I used to trade is I just overtrade all the time and I knew I was overtrading. I wasn't like overtrading a lot, just like a little bit so the person would accept. And that was often how I traded. That was how I got my trades accepted. Final question, what's your worth? Ow! That hurt! What even are these numbers? Okay, I don't know. I have no idea. I am a warrior trader. Trading is your second life. You don't know what the point of Animal Jam is without- Ouch! You know the worth of some popular items, but you might need to double check when you are dealing with an item you rarely see. You know the best places to trade and will most likely wear your rarest items when trading. You don't know the point of- Okay, thank you. Thank you for saying I'm a good trader. But ouch! I do know what the point of Animal Jam is without trading. I don't even trade anymore. To be fair, I had a trading phase just like everyone else, but like, there are other things to do in Animal Jam. And like, I don't have a problem with people trading, but it annoys me when they act like that's the only thing in the game. Like, the game it does not exist just for rares. But I'm getting carried away, so... Okay, what famous jammer are you most like? That's an interesting one. This was made in 2017, so the famous jammers now are probably not the same, but... Start with the do you play Animal Jam? If so, you may already know that there's a lot of famous jammers out there. Take this quiz to find out exactly which one you are most like. Favorite color scheme? Oh, cyan and white, pink and brown, dark red and white. This is so obvious. Red and magenta slash white and magenta. Um, I mean, not really any of them. What color is cyan? Is that like close to white or I, I don't know what that is. How would you describe yourself? A very edgy seal, super cool, Wii U, a very sneaky beaky. Oh my god, these are so obvious. <laughs> this is obviously Wisteria Moon. I don't know what this is. I mean, this doesn't seem like Ellipsity, because Ellipsity's main animal isn't a seal, but... 
I mean, it could be. <laughs> Super cool is probably a Pari. Is that Julian? Is that Julian too? I honestly don't know. This could be Rockabilly Kitty. I don't know. I mean, I don't know what else to- What the dick is from What AG animal do you love the most out of these? Regular wolf, penguin, arctic wolf slash arctic fox, owl. Arctic wolf slash arctic fox. They're cool. Like, sure, they're overused, but like, come on, items look good on them. Like, you can't deny that. Which AJ item really speaks to you? Flower crown, rare sparkly head bow. <laughs> a top hat, but it's better than answer two because it's pink and brown. Wisteria moon. Top hat slash furry hat. I'm gonna say flower crown, just because the others of these don't really look especially good. I don't know why people like top hats so much. I mean, they're not that good. Which jammer out of these is super cool? They're famous jammer's friends. Piano, Sky Cat, Julian 2. Julian 2 is a friend of a famous jammer? Alpha Can Can Powers and Bruiser. I know Bruiser is the Apari answer. This is probably the better answer? I don't know. Julian 2. I love his videos. Which one are you? Girl, boy, girl, boy, girl, girl, boy. Okay, I don't know what a girl, girl, boy is. This is like tomboy or like a gender identity question. Jam fams, cheese tigers, give me spike Plisserado, candle crocs, or edgy seals. I don't know what the edgy seals is. Is that like Rockabilly Kitty or something? Jam fams, oh no, the jam fams is Rockabilly Kitty. I know Ellipsity's edgy, but he's not a seal, so I have no idea. Like, if it were Ellipsity, it would be edgy positive phantoms. I say give me spike Plisserado. I mean, not necessarily the cheese tigers, but give me spike Plisserado is cool. I am... 30% oh god this is weird okay so my score wasn't clear for 30% I am a Pari and Bepper for the rest I am it doesn't say I am also 30% I don't know who Fruit Dove AJ is oh wow look at that you're me now cool stay edgy oh so she's the edgy seals person you're flipping amazing you love your siblings if you have any I don't and they're super fun to hang out with now the huge question is cheese tigers or give me spike plus Dorado. only the best will win animal gym quizzes quotem I've never heard of quotem what is this which animal gym alpha are you that's a good one which animal gym alpha are you what are your main hobbies and or interests exercise yoga sports no inventing creating machines gathering ideas for new inventions no music creating songs creating bass music playing a Instruments, singing, act. I mean, the singing part, maybe, but the rest, no. Combat, martial, no. Theater, acting, dancing, yes. I'm terrible at dancing, but I like it. Gardening, planting flowers, don't like that. Writing, creating stories, yes. Fashion, no. Mapping, no. Choose a word or two that best describe yourself. Thoughtful, friendly, motherly, clever, hyper, brave, soft-spoken, humorous, patient, independent. <gasps> okay, that's a lot. Um... I mean, they're not really any of these. I guess thoughtful, hyper. I guess, because I'm always singing like this for no reason. Oh, humorous, yes. Next. What is your favorite color? Other, pink, blue. Why is other first? What is my favorite color? Purple forever for all time. What do you dislike about these things? You may choose multiple answers. Traitors, bullies, romance, injustice, praise, violence. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, we can tell which one of these is Greeley. I mean, these things are all basically bad things. Oh god, that's creepy. Uh, are you an introvert or an extrovert? Introvert all the way, absolutely. I'm Graham. <laughs> Graham. That's pretty funny. Graham is the monkey shaman. Shaman? How old is this quiz? Who can always be found building, fixing, and inventing things, as well as using tools in the world. He can craft tools that other animals can use without needing hands or thumbs. He's a born tinkerer and never leaves any tool alone without trying to improve it or develop it further. Graham's personality is friendly, but he is always a little bit hyper and distracted. He mumbles to himself constantly and often throws humorous non sequiturs sequitur what the frickin' Oh, okay. Got it. Sequiters into his speech. Graham has a bizarre sense of humor and likes to play innocent pranks on new animals in Animal Gym. Isn't that more like Peck's thing? Okay, my answers. My answers were mostly Graham, then Greeley. Okay. Then Peck, and then tied for Liza, Cosmo, and Sir Gilbert. Apparently most people, the least amount of people got Graham. 
Okay then, that's like disappointing to me. Cosmo and Sir Gilbert are at the top and they're like at the bottom for me. So I'm like the opposite of most people. Okay then. What is this? What is this madness? I don't understand. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm getting very angry, so I should probably end the video now. So anyways, guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and stay colossal, awesome, awesome, and fantastic. See you all next time. Bye.